Burger, bit of rosemary, and then bacon and egg. I love burgers. For this moto adventure, I'd pack my bag with my camping and cooking gear and ingredients for tonight's burger. Then I grab my riding stuff and head on over to Canyon Motorcycles as I went to pick up a beautiful machine and the only one like it in California. So I'm here at Canyon Motorcycles because my buddy Adrian has been sending me some pictures of a motorcycle like nothing I've seen before. It's British made, it's one of a kind, and today I'm gonna take it for a spin. So, let's go check it out. Hey buddy. All right, Jamie. All right, man, how are you? Good, good. You all right? Good, it's good to see you. Yeah. But not as good as it is to see this baby. Look at that. That's You'll ne special. You've never seen one of those. Neither had I, it's and you'll never see another one. Look at it. The closer you look at it, then you see the, the real work that's gone into it. You see what I mean? I mean yeah. Mark the cold, this gauge, but I know this gauge for 25 years. That's bang on, even though it looks old. Old stuff's the best sometimes. All right, so Adrian tells me that this thing sounds like nothing else, so right. let's hear it. Jamie. I promise I will bring your baby back in one piece. There's only one of them bikes, man. <laughs> it, it ain't repeated, it's not fixable. Alright, alright. But well, you'll, you'll be good on it, man. You'll be good. I'll have fun. Alright, Jamie, you're gonna have to take this incredible machine for a spin. I chose the famous Mulholland Highway, a scenic stretch of road that twists its way through the Santa Monica Mountains like a motorcycling road made in heaven.
and as the spring flower soaked up the California sunshine, the naked Norton Dominator bellowed through this picturesque landscape like a low flying jet. So we're at a beautiful vista riding the awesome Norton. I have to say, this is a really interesting experience because the bike is really raw. My hands are actually like just still right now vibrating and tingling. And my clutch fingers are worn out because that is a heavy clutch. It really, this bike reminds me of like a old school motorbike, a motorcycle that was kind of designed in the 50s and 60s, but I love it. I can't go anywhere without someone wanting to stop, talk. We do a lot of U-turns here at MotoGio getting the shots and I can't do a U-turn without somebody wanting to pester me about it. It's a gorgeous looking motorcycle. It's beautiful to ride it on these really beautiful mellow turns. But I've got a road in mind this afternoon that's super tight and twisty. And I'm just wondering how it's gonna be. So let's go and find it and have some fun. Next choice of pavement was a twisty and hilly one, and it carves its way up the mountain with miles of fun tight turns. This exhilarating narrow and bumpy road also rewards you with breathtaking views at the summit, and it was a great place to ride the Norton. What a fun day we've had on the Norton. What a great bike. I have to say I am tingling from the excitement and the vibrations of this machine. But now it's burger time. So let's find a place to set up camp and get cooking.
We've had a lot of fun on the Norton today, but I'm hungry, so I think nothing better than a British inspired burger. So let's cook. A fry up and a burger wrapped into one. <laughs> Being swilled down with a bit from Manchester. Do you want a flake on that, love? I'm not sure there's anything better than riding your motorbike all day and then filling your belly with a big fat burger. Cheers to that. Look at that. Isn't that the beauty? <laughs> Come on. I love burgers. <laughs> Perfect. And after a brilliant day of riding an awesome motorcycle and carving great corners, I ended it by sleeping under the stars. And as I drifted off to sleep, my fingers were still tingling and my ears were still ringing from my naked Norton experience.